We're here at the Oculus Press event where they just unveiled the consumer edition of the Oculus Rift, which is going on pre-sale pretty soon and shipping in Q1 next quarter. So you'll see here it has a black sort of matte finish and a fabric overlay which will keep it protected and make it nice and soft to hold actually space for you to wear eyeglasses inside the Rift because it's adjustable, which is really important. And you can also change the distance between the eyes so people with bigger or smaller faces can use it too. There are integrated headphones, but you can remove them if you want to use even nicer ones. And with two OLED uh, screens inside it, you'll be able to see at a really high frame rate. It'll be a uh, really real wide field of vision, and you won't get that same pixel blur when you move your head around. Now this is the camera that the Oculus Rift is gonna be shipping with. The little tabletop camera will sit in front of you and it detects a constellation of tiny LED markers that are all around the Oculus headset. And that'll let it track your head movement as you move around in space. And a big surprise today is that the Oculus Rift Consumer Edition will ship with an Xbox One wireless controller. So that way you can play games right off the bat and it'll also allow you to play Xbox One games on the Rift itself. But eventually, Oculus wants to do even more with controllers, and so it today unveiled a prototype preview of this, the Oculus Touch. These are two handheld motion controllers with haptics, and what they'll let you do is you put one in each hand and you'll be able to point, move around, see your hands in virtual reality, but also pick up a gun, aim the gun and shoot it, or manipulate objects, and when you touch something, they'll actually shake and vibrate so it feels like you're actually touching something in real life. Now, Oculus has made a new program called Toy Box where you can try this out, which will let you actually play with another person in the same virtual space so you can wave to them. And it's amazing how much that'll make you feel like you're actually there. And all of these will be available for hands-on demos and uh, for you to check out at the E3 conference next week. But for now, we can only look at them. So this is only at almost hands-on.